Hi guys and welcome here. So in today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you all 10 activities and worksheet ideas of English subject for 4 to 6 year old kids. If you will use your little common sense, you can make it easier version of it or a difficult version of it for your kids uh, depending on their capability according to their age and all the worksheets that you will be seeing over here in the activities are from my 100 plus activities set which has seven subjects covered including english math science social science gk art and craft hindi it's a complete package <laughs> okay i'm gonna leave the link in the description box if you want to pay in inr you can do that if you want to pay in ult you can do that as well or if you want to pay through paypal in uh, any other currency you can still do that there are some um, worksheets that i'm gonna be sharing from her school so they are also super fun <laughs> Okay, so the very first activity idea is of picture vocabulary. You can make a whole paragraph by just giving them options, uh, you know, to choose to write in the fill in the blanks, or you can just give them pictures and write uh, and give a fill in the blanks according to child's age. I think this is very age appropriate for any kindergartner or first grader. And this way, they not only get the opportunity to practice their phonics to write uh, the sentences, but also is a writing practice. And then this kind of activity where they can, you know, write the small sentences by tracing. Then the next one is of blendings. Now, this is a part of a diagraph set. I would recommend you to go check out the diagraph set on my web shop. And I'm also going to share over here how it is. So it has activities and worksheets to practice the pre-primer um, you know blending words I mean the diagraphs and then I have provided these kind of worksheets in uh, the 100 plus activities set so kids can you know practice their blending and also use their logics to complete these kind of the worksheets. other activity idea and the topic is compound words they are super fun and so much easier to teach if they are taught through play so over here i have made this activity which is a cut paste activity to explain what is compound words like combining two words to make a new one this is the another example of uh, compound word worksheets super easy and fun again if your child is five and a half or above you can definitely go for these kind of worksheets as well there are some more which i will not be sharing because it is a part of 100 plus activity set so i want to keep some surprise right one is super super fun it is a dice game with nouns um what over here i have taken is just made the dice picture and written whatever number will come we are going to be writing over here so if we get one now for the first time then we will find things which are yellow and we'll be writing over here so this way we can take turns and write by ourselves or i can only write and she can just find the words i'll ask her to spell out the things if your kids are very young like under six year old i encourage you to do half of the worksheets or activities like this because their hands get tired of writing or help them in writing okay so the another activity idea is of noun and verb so i have these kind of flashcards which you can laminate or if you want you can paste it on a cardboard if you have a leftover of any boxes and all to make it more study but this works fine for me so what we do is i just shuffle things and ask her to find the uh, word uh, uh, find the picture which matches in the verb otherwise it goes in the noun and she has to find the place whether it has to go in a place place a place person or thing or if it is an action then it goes in verb so this is a play activity through which you can teach your kids noun and verb then uh, with that i also offer these kind of worksheets which are super easy and uh, you know fun to do for kids so they are again all the part uh, of 100 plus activity set there are some more worksheets which come with this uh, activity set but i'm gonna be keeping them secrets because i love it the other thing that you can teach is sight words to any four to five year old or six year old kids and i encourage you to teach uh, sight words only when your child is um, you know know how to read phonetically because otherwise they just mug up the words sight word set included in 100 plus activity set which have flashcards of pre-primary sight words all of them and also reading practice sheets using those small sentences uh, small sight words in a small sentences because 
they need practice and apart from that i'm going to be sharing some of these ideas which uh, has been shared by nervi's teacher these kind of activity book a small booklet you can make for uh, over here she is going to be using three sight word i am a so i am a mom i'm a dad so these kind of a small sentences they have to write and you know practice so it it gets printed in their mind so fast when they keep on writing these kind of small sentences the other one is this octopus activity um and they have so many you know pages like this one uh, over here the kid not only have to find the letter o but also the sight words they had many different poems uh, related to this so you can uh, google it and find something like that and you know make a, a small activity like this the other sight word activity is of making some kind of picture like this and asking them to sort the color in, uh, i mean sort the letters and color accordingly what it is shown over here the other one is a bumblebee activity over here uh, where they have to find the letter and so how many syllables are there how uh, and color whatever they want trace it spell it so like the particular and word they are doing it 5 6 times so it gets printed in their mind like how it is written similarly they have more worksheets related to just and now i personally i'm not a fan of creating these many worksheets i generally go with the flash cards and reading practice with the small sentences the next and the last one is the article set so this topic is only age appropriate for 5 and above kids or 5 and a half and above kids i would recommend because this is tricky when they should be using a and the this is a printable i have given in 100 plus activity set with this kind of activity there are more activities um so it is like sorting out you can again laminate or you know paste it in a cardboard to make it more sturdy but this worked fine for us so using this uh, reference page child has to sort out all these images um like sunflower what should be the sunflower if it is a and or the these kind of act, uh, you know sorting out activities are really fun and engaging for kids and then these kind of activities are also available in the set which is like just write down whether it is going to be a or n similarly you can just do these kind of activities where you can draw small pictures and ask them to tick if they are not much into writing then there is one more activity set of article uh, sorry a worksheet of article so there are more things which have been included in the set just for article but these are the things i am ready to share for now someone was asking in my one of the video if this is our backyard no i'm not that rich this is just the terrace of our building of and here is nazi playing with the gems they are not gems but they are gems okay i really hope that you guys enjoyed today's video if yes be sure to give this video a thumbs up and also share it with your friends those who have kids because i make really good content on home schooling which have been loved by so many parents so check out the home schooling playlist i'll keep the link in the description box again of those and of these activity sets and everything and if you are new found out me through this video be sure to hit the subscribe button and i will see you guys in the next one bye